Yeah, yeah, Big J TV. Like, comment, sub, like, comment, sub, man. Let's talk about it. We've been meaning to talk about it, man. I'm kind of late on this topic, but gotta speak on it. Jonathan Majors <laughs> charged with found guilty of two, let me repeat this, misdemeanors. Right? Harassment and a version of assault. Right? I don't know the exact charges, I don't know the full details. And it really doesn't matter. I'm gonna put a link inside the description but we just got to keep it real bro he did not get charged with anything that's a felony let me repeat with what i just said anything that's a felony so what does that mean a felony is something that can be charged up to you know jail time i mean as small as you know what i mean a year in jail as long as multiple years in jail he did not get charged with that he got charged with felonies sorry misdemeanors which a smaller charge probably community service a few hours of counseling, right? And less than 20 minutes later, bro, Marvel was like, yo, we done with you, right? Now, you know this channel, man. We don't approve of any type of abuse, assault, any type of touching on anybody, man, woman, child, all that. We don't, we don't approve of that, you know what I mean? But at the same time, I'm telling you what happened in my point of view. I think they're both guilty. I think Jonathan and his girl had a fight a regular fight that people have and who are couples and it got slightly physical which actually happens more common than y'all think and jonathan majors had the dumb idea of involving essentially the police in it you know what i mean and that i think is the problem bro he involved the cops in the domestic situation that they could have sat down and figured out by themselves you feel me they could have essentially went in and figured out the situation with themselves. You know what I mean? So for me, I always think about it like this. If they went to some kind of couples therapy, if he maybe talked talk to one of his homies, he, this whole thing started when Jonathan Majors called the police after finding his ex-girl laying naked, half naked in his closet. He thought that she offed herself. See, what he's guilty of in this situation, Jonathan, is dealing with a crazy broad for too long. Dealing with a crazy broad for too long, man. We've, yo, if you're out here, man, and you're dating and you're seeing women, you know the crazies, right? And the thing is, when you see the crazy, you're like, okay, maybe you can tame it. Maybe you can control, you know, the situation. But that's why she's crazy, dog. We're supposed to run away. And Jonathan Mage literally ran away. <laughs> as y'all saw on video. But for me, I look at it like this, bro. As black males, you have to understand that you're fighting against it. And you, instead of playing the game of life on easy mode, you know what I mean? Not necessarily easy mode or the right mode, you know, dealing with your peoples, people who can relate to you to a certain level, dealing with you know other folks you know it's a difference it's a massive difference now the solution is not to say never to date anybody outside of your race outside of your culture that's not always the solution the solution is being wise about your movements the solution is understanding when you're dealing with a crazy broad and when you're not you know what i mean the solution is if she's causing you to make speeches if she's causing you to make a Coretta Scott <laughs> or want her to be Michelle Obama, maybe go find a Coretta type <laughs> or a Michelle Obama type. <laughs> I mean, if you look at this woman's background, bro, she was a movement coach. Let me repeat what I just said. This woman was a movement coach. Third time's a charm. She was a movement coach. This woman had no history dealing with a man who he himself believes he's a great man. If you believe you're a great man, align yourself with a great woman who's following your leadership and not there to destroy you. This woman was so venomous, she was on trial, and I believe when she was on the stand and she cried to those jury members, that's half of the reason they found him guilty. It is what it is, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. That's the consequences of dealing with crazy. But let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Big JTV, like, comment, sub, I'm out.